what is the units digit of 7 to the 196 power? So if you try to use a calculator for this, most of them are going to, you know, not give you, uh, well, let me see right here. When I try to do it, it gives me an overflow error. Um, so instead, what we're going to do is use a little trick. Um, but first, we have to know what the pattern is. So we're going to look at other exponents starting with 0. 7 to the 0 power is 1. 7 to the 1st power is 7. 7 squared is 49. 7 cubed is 343. 7 to the 4th power is 2401, 2401. And 7 to the 5th power is 1607. No, that can't be right. 7 to the 5th is yeah, 16,807. Um, I don't need to go any further because I can see we've got a pattern. It's gone 1, 7, 9, 3, 1, and it stops here. So every fourth, um, it repeats. So if I take the exponent here and divide it by 4, since it repeats every fourth one, 4 goes into 19 4 times, 4 times 4 is 16, and subtract that we get a 3, bring down the 6, and it goes in 9 times. And with this we get a remainder of 0. So your remainder is what it's going to match up with. If it's a remainder of 0, then it's going to be the same as 7 to the 0. So the units digit is 1. Um, we could look at another example. So suppose we wanted to know what 7 to the 1 or to the 415th power is. We already know it repeats every 4. So divide 415 by 4. Uh, 4 goes into itself once with a remainder of 0. Bring down the 1. 4 doesn't go into 1 at all. And the reason I do long division by hand is because I, I need the remainder. I don't care what um, the actual value is. I need the remainder. So 0 times 4 is 0. 1 minus 0 is 1, bring down the 5, 4 goes into 15 3 times, 3 times 4 is 12, when I subtract I get a remainder of 3. So in this case, it's going to match up with 7 to the 3rd power, so the answer would be 3.